Okay, we have uh, the Quad Racer King Kong 90 GT uh, all decked out with uh, a GPS. I'm going to call it the King Kong Global Max. So uh, this is the King Kong Global Max. Um, what you see here is uh, a number of components that are integrated into the uh, King Kong 90 GT. Uh, version of the Micro F3 uh, controller, the flight controller on board, uh, with all the options uh, possibly added to uh, a sub 250 uh, gram. Um, what you're looking at is uh, the, I'm using actually a Hubson uh, 7.4 volt um, 15C battery. It's a high performance battery and uh, it gives an extended flight over the stock stock light bulb. Um, what else is in there is uh, we've got a U-Block 7 uh, Mini AP GB GPS. Uh, this is uh, configured with beta flight 1.7 uh, and um, there's also a temperature and pressure sensor, um, a barometric sensor on there and a humidity sensor. Um, this here is an OSD, it's a micro mini OSD. Uh, what else is in there? Um, the temperature and barometric pressure gauge is in here. It's, in, it's wrapped in a uh, open foam so that it doesn't uh, get disturbed by a lot of air. This is a uh, this is part of the, uh, the King Kong setup for the 5.8 um, gigahertz uh, FPV camera. That's the standard uh, King Kong FPV camera on there. Uh, this works great. It uh, flies well, so in a few minutes I'll give you a quick demo of how this uh, this works out. Uh, I just wanted to show you that this is possible. Um, right here, what you're seeing here, 198 grams, and uh, it's hooked up with a, 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 a FR Sky um, micro uh, transmitter which is buried in there. Um, what I did was uh, add some additional standoffs and uh, used a um, piece of plastic as an insulator to create a uh, another level for the uh, the new components that were added. Um, I did put the 5.8 gigahertz underneath the fiberglass um, top so it's not piggybacked on top and instead put the GPS uh, on top. The GPS is actually shielded so I, I took apart an old tablet. You'll find the um, the shielding material. You can unstick it and use that as a sticky to wrap your GPS. That's key. Um, this flies really well. Uh, it, it's um, obviously a little heavier than the stock King Kong. Uh, a little bit more sluggish, but with a new battery, it actually gives it a little bit of punch and lift. Um, oh, well, you can see I put some uh, wire tie wraps in there for legs, so that's to protect the battery. So this is more of a, a touring unit. I like to uh, use this to tour the alley in the neighborhood um, rather than uh, using it to, uh, to race. Uh, however, uh, these uh, brushless motors uh, give me some durability. Twenty nine point one four grams. So, okay, the King Kong Global Max with the Mini AP GPS OSD temperature humidity thermometer gauge, uh, and it's stock with the with the prop uh, guards. Everything is ninety six grams, so under hundred grams. Millimeter uh, King Kong drone. Global GT Max, which weighs 96 grams with the uh, 450 MAH 
crazy pony battery and we're going to connect it and fly it on the... Alright, we got that connected. 